Welcome to Tin Tevlev Box, the second channel to Tin Gaming. Pretty exciting, right? Uh, today we're looking at Game Explain and their video. They made when did this even come out? <laughs> May eighth, twenty nineteen, uh, and I have it liked. I have it liked, of course. Uh, they did feature one of my states. This is just the reason I'm looking at this is because. Uh, Derek Bittner is just such a character. He's so funny. Uh, <laughs> this whole video is great. That's really clever. Like that I don't, I don't want to sit here and like re-upload someone else's video, but it's funny. Like I, I, I'll put it up in parts. Actually, have the because uh, I cut it up. Sorry. Castlevania before you know that the gears are always a big part of that, and I like how he. Uh, explains the minimalist uh, nature of the stage by calling it the ruins and even making the uh, the, the clock faces you know part of the stage itself uh, so even um, it's just funny that these early stages they like never use the the background layer like like it's very clearly I'd say this is very clearly Castlevania I don't want to critique like a year old stage someone casually made but it's. I'm just pointing out that you know things are a lot different now, um, for the standard of stages, and I think I think the stage is great. But yeah, it's it's a smaller stage, a simpler stage, but the thought process. But like you can grab onto these, so you're like always grabbing. If you're P two, you're definitely gonna grab these just by standing here. <laughs> okay, let's not do that. Okay, this stage. I think he featured this one. I always thought it was way too big, personally. And if you press down, you can sink to the ground. I'm being picky. Can I just not be this way for two minutes? It's like, okay, that one too. I'll say whatever. It doesn't work with tethers, then you get stuck with the pineapple. Okay, sorry. Like, I know Andre just like told him to make this video or something. And <laughs> he doesn't know, like... It's not Jiggies, it's music notes. I have Same. not played Banjo Kazooie in a long time. Our fourth uh, stage that we got here, we have Treasure Trove Cove from Tevlev. And uh, yeah, for those of you who like your Banjo Kazooie, we have a Banjo Kazooie stage. And just, the way he talks is so unique. It's just, it's so great. It's a shame that he had to leave Game Explain. Andre kicked him out. It's such a shame. Just kidding, that's drama. Made up drama, as far as I'm aware. Uh, he makes a lot of comments about the clam. On the, uh, one end, on the uh, preview, but... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He jumps right off, doesn't he? Got the, uh, the, uh, clam in the background. We have the higher portion there. That's pretty cool. Love those bits. And <laughs> bits. I don't know why he calls them bits anyway. They're cool bits, right, Derek? That's it. <laughs> okay, so this is actually, this looked a lot bigger on the, uh, one end, on the, uh, preview, but, yeah, most of that's down below. Just a lot of sand. And, yeah, it's, it's uh, honestly, I love this clam. I think it looks so happy. He loves the clam. It's kind of cool. Uh, even have right over here the uh, the, the sunken ship uh, that works really well. We got the, the sh shell in the background. Yeah, I like how he calls it a sunken ship, but it's not underwater. <laughs> okay, I'm just like being a jerk at this and, of point. Of course, the notes above. But. Uh, uh, could have got a jiggy somewhere, like maybe up top there. But that's true. Still, again, a bit smaller, but I think it looks pretty good. He likes it. I love the bouncing clam. I love that clam so much. I don't know why, but he makes me happy. All right, let's go into the camera controls uh, and uh, see. You know, yeah, he thought you could go down here see. because of, you know, a lot of stages like back here. Like, you can just go everywhere with this. And I don't think that's bad that you can just, like, go anywhere in a stage where it's just, like, a lot going on with this layout. Um, but, yeah, you go to this, skipping this, but you go to this, and, yeah, it makes sense that he thought you can go down there. But I th could have sworn he described it as, like, a normal, normal stage or something like that. The sunken ship. Kind of, I guess I'm just used to that idea. Oh. Kind of, I guess I'm just... I kind of... Sorry. And, you know, get a wider berth. As you can see, wider. Look, that always confused me. Oh, the the wider berth. Uh, and uh, 
see, you know, get a wider berth. As you can see, look, I don't understand that. Reason, I thought we'd go in front. Of, in front, I kind of, I guess, I'm just used to that idea. But uh, no, I, I like that it's just a, a one flat surface, a uh, bit of an extension up here. We got the dancing clam in the background to give it a little bit more, more personality, and it kind of has the idea of a bit more of a basic stage. But the a background basic. elements really add a lot to what. To what the stage is which is kind of like other smash stages and even the background with all the water uh, back there works for it so yeah not quite what I, was, what I was expecting but i think i like it more so yeah really cool stuff and for yeah that was such a surprise seeing my stage in the thumbnail and stuff and i was like it was uh i was very excited you know uh and it's still very cool you know, this is before this is before I was a world famous uh, stage builder, so I'm like on a channel with zero subscribers <laughs> at the moment. Um, but yeah, a basic stage is what he calls it, and it's it's very much that that that's the idea I was trying to set. But the stage looks a little bit different now. Uh, I think I changed the how the way these look. Tethers, uh, if they're too long, they don't work. It might not work if you bump that. Okay. Anyway, I'm going to be here all day. I got rid of this wall. Did I put it back? I don't remember. I think I put it back. I don't know. These are backslashes. Okay. I can't not do it. I can't stop myself from pointing things out like that. Um, but yeah, the water, there's like a lot of water in the background. I've seen a very, very good Treasure Trove Cove. Someone showed me on Twitter. That looked very good. I, I don't think I could find it again, but... Um, yeah, this was very early on. I, I was thinking about just, like, making a new, um, treasure trove stage, but I, I should probably make something c completely new. But yeah, I just wanted to point that out. Like, I just, lo I love that he loved the dancing clam, you know. You know get a wider berth. As you can I don't get the wider berth thing. <laughs> Am I mishearing him every single time? Wider berth? I don't know. It's just, just a phrase people say. To give it a little bit more, more personality, and it kind of. I just love everything about this video, to be honest. I just like it. Um. Really, I think that's all that needs to be said, though. I mean, this was a year ago, and nothing else really needs to be said. Uh, that works really well. We got the the shell in the back. I don't know. That's it. I'm not like trying to brag or anything, because I know that some people, whenever I bring it up, usually because I bring it up in a in a joking way and I say they're my best friends. But <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm not trying to brag or anything. That's why I'm on the second channel talking about it. I don't want to make a whole video about this, but yeah, Alpha Rad's uh, stage builder was not a mistake video. I would like to make something with that or something. I don't know, but I also don't want to. That just seems like mooching and like harping on the past because otherwise you know look look what happened uh like a year ago like that looks kind of cool it's just not cool it's not cool um but anyway thanks for watching uh this is tin tevlev box i upload every single day for the time being uh so subscribe just for a dumb video every single day can you believe that okay thank you goodbye